Hello, hair. Hey, Dizzle. Thing, things are, are, you know, they're they're really not good. This this guy made me grab all the money from the chips and give it to him. <laughs> okay. Wait, like right now? Yeah, I, I I emptied all the chips, the two million, gave it to him. Hey, didn't he ask you about that shit earlier? Yeah, but you, like he didn't say anything else. I mean, this I. I just I, I can't believe the audacity on this motherfucker. I mean, like I said, I, I get both points, but I, I think you guys should have a conversation. But you know, I think I'm gonna move in with Kane. Okay, don't say that to there. Well, I'm on his roof right now. What the fuck do you mean, Harry? I I think you know. I finally understand you know Kane's point of view that his dad is a fucking asshole. Okay. I, I'm going to bed. I'm doing a speedy. You doing a speedy? I'm going to bed soon too. All right. Because, yeah. This, uh, this is some. This is some fucking bullshit. Fuck. Go to bed. Uh, I, I, w I really wish Leslie was around more. It's the only thing that fucking grounds that guy. Honestly, it's crazy. Well, I uh, I think that if you're going to bed, have a good night. We can talk on Monday. I think that uh, I think I think even throughout all of this, like I said, I, I've, I've been saying this the whole time. I said that I don't think anybody had any malicious intent, even with the worst shit said. Nobody had ill intent at all. And I, I feel like everybody needs to just get on the same fucking page. You know what I mean? Mm. Just remember that we're all family. Everybody needs to stick together. And uh, you know, honestly, maybe maybe we do need to reign in the chaos a bit. But at the end of the day, I also am always never been a chaos about me. Kind of who I am. I bet Lang is understand. He, he can't control people, Denzel. You can't do that. You can't you can't say reign in the chaos when I'm not around. But when I'm around, I embrace the chaos completely. Do, do you do you do you think that's fair? Uh. No, but I also don't think it's like that black and white, right? I think there are definitely days he embraces it, but there are also days where it's very clear he doesn't want the chaos, right? Like, I think there's situations that are going chaotic where I don't think he ever anticipated chaos to be, but then there's situations where he fully anticipates chaos. You know what I mean? Mm. I, 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 I think there's like a, a push and pull to everything and it's not black and white, you know? Interesting. Um, I mean, you. I mean, you don't disagree, do you? I mean, look at like. I feel like there are absolutely situations where. Well, I, I'm not gonna I, like. I'm not gonna get it because I. I was. We were. You know. This. Like, I was told to handle something and I handled it. And in terms of, like the clowns, like they are after him. Like they're definitely oh, absolutely. coming for well, we, ass. we did nothing wrong with the clowns. Well, I don't should, even think we did heard, anything wrong with Doctor You. You should have heard the conversation I had. Well, it wasn't really a conversation. You should have heard the run that uh, the fucking Bon Bon. You know, he he has gone full Joker and he's targeting Lang. And like, I think that this is always what happens: is people don't fucking listen. There is constant. I'm just tired of constant internal conflict with each other. When there's literally enemies knocking on the fucking door, and I'm taking them out, I Denzel. Agree with that. I've been I agree fucking, with that. I've been snatching up, I've been helping fucking CG snatch up these Simone fuckers. I've been on the fucking attack. I take out the fucking plans. Yet yeah, all anyone else wants to do is fucking fight internally with each other. Every yeah, I time, I he has no idea. You know the the clowns are, are looking for his ass as much as they're looking for mine. No, absolutely, I agree with you. I just don't get why everyone wants to fight with me, with fucking each other and why, you know. I 100% I agree. It was one of my biggest issues is, with the whole Kane situation was uh, I feel like right now we should be as united as possible. I appreciate, you know, when you try and, like, you know, talk sense and, you know, it's good that you stay so calm. But, like, I, I, I just hope you, you know, at least told him that, you know, the way he handles things is fucking shit. It really is. I, like, I, I did say that, that him taking people's keys and shit is, is very petty. 
And I did say what that when he, he say does that, that I, I, I don't. Today has been so cooked. He, I told him that it, when he does that shit, it, it a lot, people are to be frustrated for a reason when that happens. You know what I mean? Like, if you take, you, for example, your key to something, you have every reason to be frustrated. And, and then he brought up the point of the uranium rods and how he felt like he had to take those the keys to that shit. And I mean, it, he's not wrong because literally Speedy wanted to go yoink the fucking uranium rods right away. So I did understand why he did it, but I did tell him, like, he's got to understand when he does that shit, people will get frustrated, though. But I don't even think he actually cares about it. That's the thing. Like, we were told to handle it. He didn't give a fuck about doing this deal with Doctor Yu or not. It doesn't impact his life on the slightest. Yeah. I, I, he did bring. He brought up like uh, he did care. He did say that like he he only brought us into it because he knew we really wanted to do drug stuff, and that uh, that's the only reason he did bring us into it. He didn't feel like he had to, and that he was trying to do this shit for months, and uh, he you know he, he so I, I do get why he'd be frustrated by that, and uh, he's bringing up how like Dean worked very hard with this guy. Like, there's also the connection with Dean that also might make him a little bit extra. You know, you know what I mean? Like, it, it was one of Dean's things too. You know, so I don't, I don't blame him for like being a little bit frustrated and upset. You know. I, I just think you know the the you know I. You, you do realize, like, I literally had a, a heart to heart with Speedy one day. This guy, like, you know, after the elections, didn't come around for like nearly a week because of, like, you know, the way that he's pushed to one side. I mean, you know, me, you, and Speedy, arguably, you know, among a few others, are supposed to be like the closest people to Lang. And his actions are very self sabotaging to a point where, like, you know, a, I, I don't think, you know, if, 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 if come Monday, Speedy get shit on for all this I, I it's it's just not gonna end well you know it's like it really uh i don't know and, and uh, i don't know it, it's like uh, i do I, I my gut i don't like you know the way things are heading or the way things are looking and i i guarantee speedy feels the same considering you know me and him uh have done and will do anything for Lang. Yeah. It's it's not. I don't really think it's fair. So uh, give me two minutes. I'll wrap this up. All right. I give. Can I call you back here? I mean, we're basically done here, right? Nah, I'm going to bed. I don't know if I'll be around Monday, honestly. All right. I have a good night. What's up, Lang? Hey, did you pay the clowns to uh, attack HOA? Uh, yeah. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. man you know i i i think i i think i i think i cursed it yesterday i said you know friday is gonna be good fucking vibes everyone's gonna be happy uh i definitely cursed it for sure the vibes were not there I, the vibes are worse than they were yeah the vibes are down horrendous The the RP was pretty good though, honestly. I just I I do fear next week. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I I think the darkest timeline might have started. <laughs> 